Hi and welcome again to our video where we will cover a question many of you might have about healthy body detox. But before we will answer the question, please take your time and subscribe to our Natural Healthy Hacks channel. That way you will never miss a new video about how to boost your health and your mind. Let's get started now. The question many of you are asking when starting a body detox program is can body detox make you sick this is a very common question and it's based on a common misconception that detoxing your body can make you sick in reality detoxing your body is healthy but the side effects of detoxing that follow gives people an idea that body detox can make you sick the truth is that our diets are high in processed foods, which contain a lot of toxins. Obesity has reached epidemic proportions and for good reason. Our diets are very unhealthy. Only a minority of people pay attention to what they eat. As a result, society is fatter than ever before. One of the reasons we store fat is because the body uses fat cells to trap and bind the toxins in our body. So, the unhealthier the food you consume, the more weight you'll gain and the more inflamed your body gets. This self-preservation system keeps the toxins in check and you can get away with your unhealthy food choices for a long time before becoming sick. However, when you go through a detox, depending on what type of detox it is, you may only be drinking water or detox teas and consuming no food. And when this happens, after 24 to 48 hours, your body will go into ketosis and start burning fat for fuel. So the toxins in your fat stores will be released as they are flushed out by the body. This is what causes the symptoms which are often associated with detoxing. You may experience one or more of these body detox symptoms. Headaches, lethargy, flu-like symptoms, nausea, dizziness, mood swings, irritability, weakness, brain fog, and much more. These are the symptoms that people on the keto diet face too. They call it the keto flu, but it's all the same thing. The body is cleaning house and getting rid of all the toxins in your body. So, while you may be feeling rotten, it's actually a good thing. Whatever you're feeling is a side effect of the bad food choices that you made before. If you are addicted to sugar or caffeine, you will experience withdrawal symptoms too. Generally, the more aggressive your detox is, the worse the symptoms will be. However, they'll subside and disappear within 3 to 5 days. Once that happens, you'll experience mental clarity and suddenly feel like you have more energy than you ever had before. Your body will be cleaner from within and healthier. Going through this sickly phase is part of the deal when you are detoxing. If you go about it the slow and steady way by following a raw food diet or a juice diet, your symptoms will be less severe, but it will take a longer time to detox. If you choose a method like water fasting or lemonade diet for 5 to 7 days, your symptoms will be worse. The body will lose a lot of water as it flushes out the excess salt that's lingering in your system too. Which method you choose to use is up to you. If you are using natural methods to detox, you must understand that it's not the detox that's making you sick, but what you ate in the past and the existing toxins in your body that are now being eliminated, which are causing you to feel ill. 
So proceed with your detoxing in a sensible manner and you may wish to speak to your doctor before embarking on a detox. Did you like this video? Don't forget to give us like and also tell us in the comment section below this video what other healthy topic you would like to get information on. We will research the topic and make new video for you. And one last thing. If you did not do it before, hit the subscribe button and be the first one to see our new videos when they get published. On the next video, we will talk about the five tips that will make you healthier with body detox. See you there.